sports fans, welcome to the broadcast booth. I'm Jason Aaron Goldberg, and this is Car Collecting Shenanigans. While you're here, hope you'll subscribe. It's turn to Tuesday, and today we're going to believe in the fat pack and rip a fat pack of Stadium Club and Tops Fire. But as you can see, we've got a very busy Shenanigans card park today. So let's swing it around the horn and talk about the dugout, guys on the field, a couple quick shout outs. Uh, so, first up, Obviously, it's game one of the World Series today, and Tyler Glass now is on the bump, and I thought I'd pull this guy out, which was pack pulled back in the day, still working on my 2017 Ginter set, but I pulled this, had no idea who Tyler Glass now was. Now we know the kid can hurl. I'm sure he'll hit 100 a couple times, uh, but yeah, I sleeved this up, and I got this rookie card there, so I guess a rookie card relic, cool yellow Pirates color. He uh, obviously came over to the Rays in that deal. He came over with Austin Meadows. Uh, yeah, so there you go. Tyler Glass now on the bump. Also in the dugout today, we got Mickey Mantle, number seven, Mickey Mantle, because uh, it's his birthday today. Uh, he was born on this day in 1931, which I believe would make him 89 or 90. Uh, somebody else do that math. I don't know which one he would be. Uh, but picked this card up uh, many, many months ago. Uh, another one that I did not know really existed, got back into the hobby, came across it on eBay, numbered out of 199 so I thought I'd break it out for Mickey's birthday. Pretty cool card. Also, uh, on the field today, I mentioned this, I put it in the, uh, the, uh, community tab, uh, got a couple of likes on it, so people saw it, but, uh, when I pulled the Corey Seager card out yesterday out of my pink chrome binder, Discovered that I had actually pulled two Randy Arosa Reina pink chrome rookie cards. Hurricane Randy, I call him. Uh, we'll see how he does in the World Series. I don't really have a dog in this fight. I'm just hoping for a good World Series. Uh, but also on the field, we got Oral Hershiser. Here's rookie card, because on this day in 1988, the Dodgers won the World Series. Oral Hershiser was the MVP. Got two wins in that. And in 88, the Lakers also won the NBA title. So will we see a repeat? Another Dodgers-Lakers championship? Either way, uh, so in 88, that was the first time a city had had two champions in different leagues, right? They had uh, the Lakers and the Dodgers. And this year, we're going to have it again either way with the Tampa Bay Lightning winning the Stanley Cup uh, and then the Lakers winning the title. So either way, we're going to get that double up. Um, okay. Also want a quick shout out to, uh, Ken's Cardboard for correcting me. I thought they were going to play straight through in the World Series like they've done, uh, but they are taking days off. Basically, the schedule is today and tomorrow, day off Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, day off, and then back to Monday, Tuesday, uh, if necessary. So we'll see how that goes. Uh, also quick shout out to Russ Jackson, the only person who answered my question about if I should show off the glow-in-the-dark where monsters live. Uh, so I'm putting that question out there again uh, if anybody would like to see that early uh, rather than waiting until Ginter week to that end. Also, shout out Like a Hawk Cards who posted his Allen and Ginter X break this morning. Uh, it was pretty fun. I got the email notification that mine is on the way. Uh, still going to save it for the Ginter Geek Out week. Uh, but stay tuned for that. Uh, okay, I think that's it. Let's get into the Rippage Lucky Cup. Get in the box. Can you deliver for the people? Should we have a sip? Let's have a sip. All right, let's get into it. As always, check the description below for the link to the Clary's Goldberg Scholarship. See cards you like. They can be yours for a pledge. Let's do the fire. Fire first. Now, uh, you know, I don't know if we're going to get, although we got something there, it, it's kind of bowing out a little bit, maybe two things bowing out, and the reason I'm looking at that is the, the autos in fire are sticker autos, and I got to shout out Abel in Vegas because he uh, posted this a while back, actually maybe he didn't post the video, he ripped it off camera, but he basically picked up like four fire packs at uh, uh, Walmart and or Target, wherever the fire is, Target I think. And uh, he pulled the Luis Rubber autograph. That's his second one he's pulled. So we'll see if maybe we get like Cedric Mullins, everybody's favorite Oriole. We got here Matt Tice. Tice. 
That might be numbered. Yeah, it is. Look at that. 63 out of 299. I don't know what's going to happen with him. Uh, if you know, Is he going to take pool hole spot? Is he even in the big leagues? I don't, I don't think he played much this year. Nolan Arenado. I'm going to set that one aside. Speaking of Ken's cardboard, got a little package I'm working on for him. number of packages have been going out. The other day, Wickelex got his. Braden Burks, shout out to you. Uh, I had been working on a Dodgers and Corey Seager-centric spoils pack for him. Uh, and then, obviously, Seager went off and won the NLCS MVP. But your package went out today. So there you go. Uh, I need to do another giveaway. I just haven't had one in a while. Uh, and I was thinking about doing stuff like having, you know, these random questions in videos and then doing giveaways. But as I learn here, come on now, with the uh, the Monster Minis, I don't know if people like me, they fast forward through videos or whatever, but, you know, no one answered, other than Russ, no one really answered the question on the Monster Minis. So I don't know if that'll work, uh, unless it's, like, really specifically listed as a giveaway and people watch the whole episode. Interesting that the security tag is not card-sized. Usually they're... Exactly the same. All right, Kraken. I don't know what's going on with the Kraken. A lot of hubbub in Yankee universe about uh, Gary Sanchez. What are we going to do with this guy? Dansby. Got to admit, playing great. Was very excited to pull that Allen and Ginter frame mini auto at Dansby. And uh, we'll see if he you know, has another great year next year. Braves were fun. Ooh, Aquino. Braves were fun to watch. I think, uh, you know, they, the Padres, a lot of these teams are great young players. Oh, no. Don't do that, Jason. Don't bang up your potential superstar rookie cards. Griffey, whoa. I don't think I've seen this one yet. Look how high he is. You're talking about Mookie Betts robbing home runs. Don't forget, Mookie Betts was like a multi-sport star. Uh, and he can dunk. I think it was he 5'9", 5'10". He can dunk, so he can get up there. That, that's really high. Tommy Edmond. The Bambino! Oh, reverse. That means probably red. I don't think that's an image variation on Babe Ruth. I do believe there is an image variation Ruth card. Yeah, that's not it, though. So this is probably a red. Oh, we got two backwards. So let's, let's do this, and then we'll flip it. Victor Robles. Not bad. Elvis Andrews. Mitch Hanaga. Hopefully he can come back. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Oh, it's Willie Calhoun, red, and Sepia, Manny Machado. I got, you know... I got to shout out Manny Machado. It's not in this picture, but he is rocking the mutton chops. He was rocking them all season. They're weak, uh, but I give him credit for at least breaking out the mutton chop. And the mutton chop is basically the like the big sideburns with the mustache and the goatee, but it's kind of broken up. I talked about it in Raleigh and the Goose, uh, but it's you don't see a lot of the mutton chop in the show this, these days. And Manny's breaking it out. So there we go. Actually, so fire, not so great, but this fat pack, pretty good, I would say. You know, I mean, Willie Calhoun, give or take, but a nice Aquino rookie, Sepia, the babe. There you go, everybody. So leave a comment. Let me know what you thought of turn two. Leave a comment. Let me know who you think is going to win game one and the World Series. I look forward to reading those. Slam that like button. Make sure you're subscribed to all your friends. And I'll see you next time in the broadcast booth.